Hello everyone, this is Sharad Nalapati from Hyderabad. By profession, I am a senior engineering and global delivery leader responsible for enterprise business intelligence, data platform and data analytics. Working for Hitachi Vantara and have two decades of corporate experience in IT industry. My qualifications are MTech in IT, MBA in Marketing from Madras University, MPhil in Management from Madras, Bachelor of Laws from Osmani University, and then PG Diploma in Software Marketing from Ponchin University. So far, my experience with EBA Master Class, the concepts in this class are clearly explained, articulated, and it is very good for anyone from freshers all the way to the folks who are having a decent number of years of experience in this industry or from any other industry. Every week I feel like that I'm learning something new in the sector and it is just not about a theoretical class but it's an experiential learning with practical assignments. Right? And one would ha have an opportunity to learn from the industry leaders, market players, ecosystem enablers, policy makers and startup leaders. Right? And how is it helping to reach my goal? At the end of the class, right, uh, you'll be excited and you'll be equipped to solve some complex and challenging problems that provide in this industry. Right? And this is just not about knowing the math mathematical equations or calculations, but about solving some problems in practical nature. Right? It is surpassing my expectations because it just not talks about only EV, but it talks about the industry players, how the market is actually responding towards uh, you know massive changes that are happening in the last four to five years. And you would also get to know the schemes and the plans such as FAMES 1.0, 2.0, ME, MMP. And it would also help you to learn all the way from the basics to the core concepts to solving some practical calculations such as you know, knowing the rolling resistance, aerodynamic forts or the, you know, uh, certain crucial parameters in terms of knowing the range or the battery requirements or how much um, traction is required or what are the different controllers, what are the different battery types that are available, what are the different charges that are available. So in summary, is it's an experiential learning as I stated before, right? Now, mentors are the biggest differentiators for this course. So far, we had an opportunity to meet with industry leaders like uh, Sulaja Firodia from uh, Kinetic Engineering and Green uh, Energy from the Kinetic, Kartike Hirani, the Managing Director for the Charge Zone at Tesco Energy, and Priyank Danukar from EU ABI, Gopal Krishnan, Director of Auto Mobile and Automotive from Government of Telangana. Last but not the least, our so-called Rajiv Vyasar, who has completed his B.Tech and M.Tech from IIT Madras, and he has worked with industry chains and um, very prominent brands such as Avan India, Gati, Bosch, Mahindra and Mahindra, to name a few, and senior leadership roles. Right, and the teaching style and the pedagogy that is adopted in this course, right. So before that, let me talk about right. The COVID-19 has impacted everyone by and large, not excluding the education sector, right? So I was having a little hesitation that this course would really help me. If so, how is it going to help me? Because it's an online course. So, however, with certain iota of ambiguity and doubt, I thought, okay, let me give it a try. I joined the course, and within uh, probably a week or two, I started gaining confidence and I'm learning something new other than what I've been into this industry right uh, completely into an IT. So having the classes you will also be taken to certain industry visits which is in person where you know the shop floor, the manufacturing, how it happens and different areas that are actually existent in this market right which gives you the conceptual and practical exposure to this industry. Now, How do we get the questions or any doubts clarified? Because every week before we start the second week, we actually spend some decent amount of time discussing and uh, knowing what has been discussed in the week one, 
any questions or clarity required we spent uh, at least some good amount of time and our questions are clarified and second thing we do assignments hand in glove with the mentor and then if you have any doubts we'll get it clarified before we are asked to take on the further assignments as a homework right now that my strong recommendation to anyone who wants to pursue this course please think please consider this as your first choice or a first preference because if you are from electrical chemical mechanical or an electronics background wonderful even if otherwise if you are not like me don't worry because across all the ages which are industry or in if you are really enthusiastic about making a career or want to transition into this industry in whatever form or shape it is this program is very apt for you right so please take this um, you know as an op- not as an option but as a you know preferred choice so that you can really succeed in this industry right and i wish everyone all the very best and once again happy new year thank you raju and team for giving me this opportunity uh, thank you once again